不是因为我写的很精彩，而是中国故事就很精彩。一四年到的中国，我一下飞机就觉得终于回家的感觉。我的目标是让更多的西方人去了解中国一下，因为我喜欢中国的文化，所以这是我的一个梦想来这里。道可道，非常道；命可命，非常命。无名，天地只是由命，万物之母。孤唱无余，一贯气妙。这位诵读《道德经》的英国人名叫岸真，定居中国已有二十多年，做过英语老师、演员等职业。如今，他与同样来自英国的妻子杜玲一起在北京经营着一家文化公司，通过组织书法、国画、武术等中国传统文化工作坊的形式，向来到中国的外国人们普及中华文化。和许多外国人一样，岸真最初是因为喜欢中国功夫而来到中国。中国日新月异的发展和友好的人民吸引了他，让他决定留下。但他心中始终有一个功夫梦。After I got with my, you know, to be wife, and I started saying, well, you know, I always had this dream of, you know, learning more about Chinese culture and sharing China with the world. She really encouraged me, so we went back to the Shaolin Temple. I said to the the leaders at the temple, you know, what do you think about us working with you? And they said, yeah, that would be great. 为了能够更深入地了解中国功夫、中国文化，更好地与少林寺合作，岸真常常到寺中学习。正是在这一过程中，他对中华文化中道和禅的哲学思想产生了浓厚的兴趣。The more time I spent there, the more I started learning about Buddhism, Chan Buddhism. That's when it clicked for me again, and I started to see how all the different parts of traditional Chinese culture, whether it's martial arts or calligraphy or painting, it all ties back into the same thing: Chan Buddhism and Taoism, which are the center of basically all culture here. People come here for calligraphy classes or painting classes, but they don't just do the calligraphy. You know, this is why we give a background presentation. 二零一三年，岸真和杜玲在香港注册了公司，后来又将公司搬到内地。他们在本地的传统文化专家和来华外国人之间架起桥梁，组织了多种多样的中华传统文化课程。他说，外国人在学习了中国文化后，最常说的一个词是惊讶。They see the picture of the bamboo before they start. They'll say, "But it, it's so boring. I, I want to paint something, you know, complicated and interesting." And we will say, "It's okay. Just just have a try." And then after an hour, they say, "My God, that's the most complicated thing I've ever painted." So traditionally, ink was in the form of ink sticks simply because it was easier to transport. Um, but now, liquid ink is commonly used, as you can see in the bottles there. So this is made of soot, so pine soot or oil soot. But the floor of the bamboo first. So we have the main stem. You have side stems. You have leaves. 虽然并不是中华文化的专家，但是岸真和杜玲凭借着他们的一腔热爱，成为了中华文化积极的传播者。他们说，希望通过他们的工作坊，让来到中国的老外们都能像他们一样，感受到中华文化的魅力。People come here for two or three hours. They're not going to master. Something in that time, but if they can try it, and then they say, "You know what? I really enjoy this. I want to learn more about it." That is what we are trying to do. We want people to realize that Chinese culture is accessible, and to encourage them to find out more information.